Uh, what's Rigid Force Alpha? Uh, that's something I've been playing. It sounds a, like an adult game. Um, okay. <laughs> that's what Shipwreck yells out when he gets his double erection. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Rigid Force Rigid Alpha. Force Alpha. Rigid Force Alpha. It'll be the beta. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> uh, Rigid Force Alpha is it's like a uh, classic shmup side scroller shmup where you're a spaceship and you're shooting other spaceships and alien bugs and stuff. Um, it's I've played through most of it I think at this point. On what? This is I'm playing it on Xbox. Okay, how does it look? Uh, it looks like an updated 2D shmup. Like it, it's not going to blow you away graphically. No, but that's looks, a bummer. It looks. I fine. like when shmups are like graphically knock me out. It, that yeah, but at the same time, like that makes your eyes bleed and dry out as well. <laughs> yeah, but that's what I'm looking for. My guess. that's what you're looking for in this one. <laughs> I got it. Uh, this this one, it's the mechanics of it are good. It it has the thing like where you have your little satellite chips and you can have them shoot behind you or shoot in different arrays and everything. Uh, and it also has a, a sword that you can swing to as a block button, basically. So you don't have to dodge all the bullets. You can just use your block button. Uh, so it's on the easier side of shmups because of that. Not but, so rigid force alpha. Uh, yeah. It's a bad name. I, every time I have to remember what is it is. Is your spaceship pink? Are you flying a pink spaceship? Yeah, it looks like a big penis, if that's what yeah. you're wondering. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just it's a it's a double erection both <laughs> ways, so you can shoot forward and backwards at the same time. Shit, nice. Yep. Um, that's a different game, I think. I'm pretty sure that <laughs> game exists. I think it does. Yeah. Uh, what else? Oh, here's the big goosebumps news that everybody was waiting for. Oh, we're to that part of the show. <laughs> the money part of the show. Yeah. So I also got sent a code for uh, Goosebumps Dead of Night. Which oh, is I didn't know new... this was a new game. This is the new Goosebumps game, not to be confused with the earlier Goosebumps game. Yeah, I thought you just like picked that up cheap. Okay, how's this new Goosebumps game? This new Goosebumps game is a first-person uh, horror game for kids. So... It's got Jack Black in it, first of all, which I was surprised that they got Jack Black in this game. Um, but you start off and you're in like R. L. Stein's house, and it's got a bunch of the monsters from the movie, like the werewolf with the uh, gym shoes on, and what? Uh, what was in there? <laughs> the werewolf. <laughs> Woof! You call them sneakers? Is that sorry? Was it was it the gym shoes? The sneakers was the part you were getting Just... on. <laughs> I say Wolfman, but that's fine. Wolfman? Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's right. Wolfman with sneakers for people in New York, I guess. Uh, but, uh, and it's got Slappy. and Slappy's in it, good. Basically, you're wandering around the house, kind of, uh, remember the game D? Did you ever play that? I know of it. the game, yeah. but Okay, so it. it's a first-person game, and... and so you're looking for different clues. Basically, it's very base level. You're looking for pages to these books. If you've seen the movie, that's so how is it any good for kids? Yeah, it's fun. Mm-hmm. Like my kids, both of them were like running around the room as I was doing it. Because the, the whole conceit is essentially there's like a zombie girl comes out and you have to like hide under a bed until she goes away. That's you basically have to run to places to, to hide inside the house. Only possible on the power of PS5. Well, maybe not. <laughs> yeah. I, I've i been playing this one on Xbox as, as oh, well. I guess I was but wrong. It's, I mean, it's a kid's game. It, it's it's fun for if you have kids. Good. I'm and glad if you you're like having fun. Werewolves and gym shoes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's move on to what? There's a new Fortnite season. New Fortnite season started yesterday. There was like a big, there was a big event that was so big you couldn't even get into it. Unless... I know, I got into it. Well, you're famous, so I, I am. No, I just happened action. to log on to it at the right time. Oh. And uh, although I was on a call when it was happening, so it was happening over my shoulder, and I could hear my son screaming as everything was happening. But it was, it was not as good as the Travis Scott concert, which I know you saw. I did see. I like that. That was bananas. Yeah. 
this was not quite as bananas. It was cool, you know. It was like, all right, this is, this is you know, they're doing something. But uh, the new season came out. I picked it up. Um, I have one challenge left to do for this week, which I'm two thirds of the way through on. So then I'll have this week all sorted out. I'm already level 21. Um, I got myself the scuba diver. Got to get that scuba diver guy. And nice. uh, they, they did a good job with the, with the new map. So they flooded the map. That's what happened. So they wow. flooded the map and now like, Two thirds of the map are underwater, and uh, so they had to add Aquaman to the game, and sharks, and sharks will eat you. But if you catch a shark with a fishing rod, you can uh, jet ski behind it, water ski behind the shark. Wow! Is it, can you yeah. shoot and do that at the same time? I don't know. I haven't tried that. It's very possible you can though. Pew, pew. That'd be good. So yeah, you gotta watch out. Also, if you're standing on the dock too close to a shark, the shark will jump out of the water and try to eat you. So you gotta is, be. Is careful. this uh, Jason Momoa, Aquaman? There, it, it is mostly the Jason. It's the Jason Momoa Aquaman with the classic Aquaman costume, but you can unlock just shirtless Jason that. Momoa in cargo pants. But what? what there's no Aquaman movie coming out now right or like what's the tie-in uh the tie-in is the people Snyder like cut. aquaman and jason momoa so the last month okay. last season passed i should say it was deadpool it's not okay. like there's a new yeah okay sure. who doesn't want to just use aquaman here spend your you know whatever it is nine dollars and fifty cents nope. get the season pass you get like seven new skins plus an aquaman you get a a little kitty cat that rides a motorcycle that shoots while shooting guns. I just want more DJ concerts. That's what I want. I'm sure there will be more. Those are fun. Yeah. I'm sure they'll be, we'll do more of those. Cause I think that last one was very successful. So, so is Aquaman shooting guns? Is that yes. Aquaman on? will shoot guns. I know it's very weird. I'm not, no, don't, don't get me wrong. I'm right there with you. Aquaman is going to shoot guns. And run around a map, and he's going to break stuff, probably with his trident. He's going to break rocks. and Although you can probably give him whatever you want. So you can give him any axe you feel like giving him. Aquaman. Yeah. Aquaman. All right. Yeah. I feel um, like they're just saying, who cares? People are going to buy this no matter what we do yeah, yeah. at this point. Anyway. Like, Kind of. Although that you know, I would say it's sort of the opposite. For something that they could just throw out, throw out garbage. Well, and people are gonna buy it no matter what. They needed something water themed for the. Yeah, water. I so think they actually. What put were the some, options? They put some thought and effort into it. They're trying to tell you know a story, so to speak, that they've been trying to do since the beginning of chapter one. And, uh, and you Aquaman know, is crucial for telling that story. Uh, Aquaman <laughs> is not crucial for telling that oh, story. Yeah. That's the whole point. It's oh. like here's the season pass. Here's all this stuff. That sort of flows with this, you know, nonsense story that they're trying to tell. You think Namor and also, is and here's Aquaman. Why not? <laughs> right. right. Why, why? I don't is understand why anyone only... has a problem with that. I'm still trying to comprehend it. So, is he the only Aquaman themed character in this? Yes. Now, what they did last season with the Deadpool stuff was they did sell the X-Force characters, if you wanted them, like, separately. Like, okay. if you wanted to have Cable, you could buy Cable for 12 bucks. So they're going to add, like, Black Manta to this. I wouldn't be surprised if they have a an Aquaman Friends pack that comes out that's like, yeah, Black Manta for, like, 15 bucks. Sweet. And, and like, wait. a dolphin. I'm mm -hmm. trying to think of who Aquaman's friends are. Probably, like, his, the, the wife lady. Mera. Mera, or, yeah. They'll do Mera. They could do Black Ocean, Manta. Ocean they could do, Master. Well, yep, I was going to say uh, Orm. I, same I thing. guess. Yeah, I guess. Fish Face. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's really it. It's those three. Crab Boy. Don't forget about Crab Boy. He's they really only popular. had three X-Force people. They had Psylocke, Domino, and Cable. So, sure. Yeah. Those are the main ones. Yeah. So this works. That works. Those three char extra characters, and that's pretty much the same four characters that are in every Aquaman story I've ever read or cartoon that I've ever watched. Uh, who else do you need, really? Aqualad. I... Who is Aqualad? 
Aqualad is the little boy that runs around with him. Is he, he wore son? a red shirt and blue shorts? Where did he come from? I don't know. I don't know. Although Aquaman you watched, fucked a whale, and then uh, you watched Aqu- Young Justice, where it was like uh, the Black Manta's son was an Aqualad for a while too, wasn't he? Yes, something yeah. like that. Yeah. So. <clears throat> yeah, that was a good yeah. show, by the way. Mm-hmm. 